Hey guys, it's Shan, and today I'm going to be reviewing a 8.5 inch LCD writing tablet. But before we go ahead and start this video, make sure you guys go ahead and click on that subscribe button and hit that like button. But other than that, let's go ahead and start the video. Now this is an 8.5 inch writing tablet as I said in the beginning. Now it does come with a stylus pen and the actual board and on the board has the holder for the stylus pen, a lanyard strap to uh, with a hole and also a battery slot plus an erase button. Those are all the buttons on it. It's very thin this board. Now a couple ways of using this can be when you get a phone call, you guys got to jot down some notes of someone's name, address, number and all of that. You guys have the ability to write it down over here as it will save a lot of trees. But this is not only something to write down with, you guys can go ahead and draw some things or also just take down some notes if you guys want. But that's all up to you. So whatever you guys can imagine, you guys can actually write or draw or whatever you think you guys can do. You guys can do that on here as whatever you guys would normally write on paper, you guys can write it over here as it will save a whole bunch of more paper as you guys are just writing on this. When you guys are done, there's an erase button what clears out the whole board. The only downside to this is you guys cannot save your actual work. The only way of saving it is by taking a photo. It is actually really easy to write with this device. It is just like you're writing on a tablet or also on paper. It's not even that hard. The only thing is you guys won't get actual good viewing angles as you guys can only view the tablet when you guys are actually facing it because the angles on it are just really horrible. But that's not that much of a downfall as you guys will actually be seeing it most of the time straight up. But it's great. But it could be better when you're showing someone, you have to make sure that you're showing them straight up. Otherwise, they won't actually be able to see what you guys are doing. Now, you guys are probably wondering how the battery life is. It runs on a 3 volt battery, what is good to last up to 2 years on different types of usages. But around 2 years in the end, what is actually really good. If you think about it, you're saving a whole ton of trees from just writing on this, taking photos and jotting down some notes and all of that just on this one device and clearing it out later on which is actually really a good use for it and you guys don't need to charge it all the time as you guys will always know that you guys can use it for a very long time before actually having to change the battery. Now the only downside of writing on this is if you guys make a mistake the only way of erasing someone is actually by hitting that delete key what erases the whole board. So if you misspelled something or had made a mistake along the way of drawing or something, you guys cannot erase it. So you guys would have to scratch it out and redo that part or having to erase it and start all over. That is one of the biggest downsides of this. But again, not too bad viewing angles and all that. There are some downsides, but it's a very good device. So in the end, guys, I would say I would definitely actually recommend this device as it was actually a really helpful device for all you guys out there. There's only a couple downsides as not very good viewing angles and then again you guys have to always delete things completely if you made a mistake. There are some couple downsides but then again you're saving a lot of trees, you're writing quicker, being able to know that it's temporarily there or even if you guys just take a photo it's always on something and you're just ending up saving some time. But that's all for the video today, guys. If you guys did like the video, make sure you guys go ahead and hit that like button. Also, make sure you guys go ahead and click on the subscribe button and follow my social media links down in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the next video.